Today, we're going to identify points, lines, rays, and line segments. We're doing this so that we can correctly name each one and their attributes. So attributes is just a fancy word for characteristics or the details, what makes them. So we have point. Here's our first word, point. A point is just exactly that, one spot. Um, it marks the end or the start. Points in lines, rays and line segments, usually have letters. These points on this um, page right here, they can be named anything. They could be in order, A, B, C, D, alphabetically, they don't have to be. You could go with J and L, right? You're missing that K in the middle, doesn't matter. Each point has its own letter assigned to it. Next we have a line. A line is an endless straight path with no end. So you can see there's points here. Let's say it's point A and point B. These points mark each arrow in a sense. They're telling you, okay, this is line A, B. So if I were to write line A, B, then I would write the two letters I see, A, B, and then above it, I'm going to draw a line. Now, because it's a line, I have to draw both arrows because that shows it does not stop. It's going on with no end in sight. Rays. Ray is part of a line with a single endpoint. So if we have this here, CD, Ray CD, it stops here, here's my endpoint, and it goes on in that direction. I like to think of rays like coming off of sunshine, right? They start at the sun, there's their endpoint, and they just all the way down to earth. So this is Ray CD. A line segment is just part of a line with two endpoints. So it has two endpoints, a segment. So right here, you can see I have my arrows, right? So it's a line, but if I'm focused on just the points, I can turn it into a segment. So this, let's say if it's KL, you would write KL and put your segment above it. So a segment is just part of the line. It doesn't matter that this looks, is a ray, right? You still have a line segment within it. Here is a segment on its own, right? You have your endpoint, line, endpoint. And then this is a line with a line segment within it. So if you look up here, at this line, you also have segment AB because you also have this line segment within that line. So today what we're gonna do, um, you're gonna answer questions like this on IXL. You are going to look and say, okay, is this a ray? Is it a line? Is it a line segment or is it a point? I see there's two endpoints. So this is a line segment. This one has two arrows going on. So I know this is just a line, one point. Here I have one endpoint going on in the opposite direction. So that is a ray, like a ray of sunshine. Here I have two endpoints. I know that's a line segment. And then once again, oh, arrow, arrow. That is a line. Pay close attention to what is on the ends, whether you have endpoints, lines, um, arrows, or if it's just a point itself. Pay close attention to the ends of your lines.